peace agreement with his victim. The 26-year-old could be free in just over a month. Cricket legend Adam Gilchrist is teaming up with the WA government for a tour of India in a bid to secure flights between Perth and the subcontinent. Negotiations are underway and a million dollars is already set aside to promote our state. Gilchrist and McGowan. <laughs> a partnership the WA government hopes will be a winner. My co-opening batsman here, the Premier over in India, and we'll take it on in, uh, and represent the state very, very well. As a cricketer, Gilchrist had plenty of success in India. And don't worry about setting a field of that. <laughs> when he and the Premier head there next week, they're chasing another win, securing direct flights between India and Perth. Geographically, it's, it's so close. It makes sense. This can easily be the gateway to Australia from, from that region. Adam will be there participating in events and meetings and the like. India's clash with South Africa at Optus Stadium in next year's T20 World Cup will be part of the pitch to bowl airlines over. In a war to beat Queensland to the service, an offer has already been tabled with Vistara Airways to commence flights next year. We're going to throw in a lot more money. The Premier and, and Adam will go over there and, uh, and raise our profile, raise awareness. So why India? Well, it's the fastest growing aviation market in the world and currently the ninth largest in international visitors here to WA. And we're seeing that number soar with a growth of 11.1% in subcontinent visitors in just the last year. Plenty of reasons for the McGowan government to get this tour right. Oh, Joshua Dorn, 9 News. Time for a check of weather now with Elizabeth Creasy and Liz, a cool day.